Hello everyone, my name is Forrest Satterfield and I'm going to do a 360 walkthrough of the Stanford D School, uh, mainly because it's cool, um, but also for like useful things. So look at this, so whiteboard like T-shaped walls. I think that's awesome. Let's see, you got stools. Now these stools are actually purposely designed to not be comfortable for too long and they go with tall tables, which it doesn't appear that I can find right now as I spin you around. Uh, whiteboard tables you see here on Z-Wax, racks. these are all made in-house and they're actually made pretty pretty effectively. It's, and you see all the, the raw materials of everything. I really like. You see the tall desk right here that I was talking about. Um, you have the couches, everything's on wheels. This, this is locked in place so I'm not going to move it. Uh, foam cubes over there. Uh, rapid prototype materials. You got everyone as well. I'm actually going to walk, this, this area we'll come back to later, but it's, it's amazing. I'm going to walk into a dark room, but it was one of the rooms that we used, so I need data. Ah, lights. Maybe? Maybe? Oh, I don't know what I just did. Haha, -ha, I did something. So, check this out. And, and of course everything's still on wheels, except for the chairs, but the chairs can be easily moved and stacked. Uh, you have the, the openness, really of the space it's amazing and hopefully you're looking around not just looking at me because I'm there are pictures of me you don't need a 360 video to see me I believe this is whiteboard and it goes all the way to the top that's awesome you got expo markers walking over here you got this kind of area in the back not really quite sure I should be back here but it's too late now the video has begun there's a lot of gongs around here uh, that they use to like sig signal that the end is the end of the activity, not the end of the days. No, oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, that's cool. Neat. Okay, so I'm gonna keep running, and I am still good. I think I still have footage. I'm gonna keep moving. Do do do. This place is amazing. Do do do. Okay. Uh, off. Aha, I know how to use that. I think this is the, this room right here is their maker space, but I'm not quite sure. Don't stop believing. Okay, now we're in like the base studio area. Now this is really cool. It's a completely adaptable space where people are able to work on their projects uh, and then they take them. These, these are removable whiteboards. Removable whiteboards right here. I can remove them, work on a project, and then when I you know, take these down, put them on a rack, and then when I need to work on my project, I bring it back here. So that way the space is completely, uh, it's, it's not static. You know, projects don't take up that much room. Hey, y'all. Yeah. So you see how it's all kind of laid out. Oh, over here, talk box. Really cool. It's a box. Um, are you talking? Audio, music stuff. Uh, I can't really show you these offices over here because that's, that's private and it would be rude. Um, but I'm going to keep going. See, all the, the raw materials and everything's just exposed and it's really cool. These are all whiteboards. Anything that's white is whiteboard. And it's like on both sides and everything. Oh, wait, definitely got to show you this. Can you imagine working here? I mean, this just looks cool. And you, you take this whiteboard off, it's like the table you can draw on, you have the light right here that you're able to work with. That's, that's fantastic. And you have all the tools very clearly laid out and labeled here. And it's, it's very easy to take things but also put them back. Uh, you have the, the signage that shows you how to reset the space. You have probably people's work that they would rather I not show. Um, the signs, you know, taking the really the whole space of it. Everything is just all going around reinforcing the culture. This is our food and drinks. I'm going to eat and drink some of that later. Then we go in here, we're in Studio 2. These have couches and everything. This whole room, everything can be moved around. It's on wheels. It's easy to, to just adapt the space to your needs. You have all the, the sticky notes and everything, all of our progress. Uh, you, you see just all the connection board stuff and and food and it's just great absolutely great so I'm gonna keep going this way hello everyone hello. Hey, okay we're going out the hallway yeah it's cool so these are whiteboards I was talking about you know different projects that people are working on they're all clean because it's the beginning of the semester 
So you would expect these to not be in use, but they will be. So, whiteboards, whiteboard, 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 all these whiteboards. Studio 4, you can kinda, kinda see inside. Okay, you got the Extreme Studio, which I don't think is being used, but in case it is, I don't want to um, get, uh, it, I don't wanna um, see people's projects that um, they would rather we not see. I will not show you the bathroom, although imagine it's an innovative bathroom. Go across here. See across everyone. Hey, hey Romero. Recording. So we're gonna go over here, and we'll be wrapping up very shortly. Hopefully, this will be picked up uh, with the video. It's not too dark. If it is, oops. Uh, going down these stairs. Everyone's having a good time. A classroom over here, you have a kitchen area. <laughs> kitchen! I'll admit, not the most innovative kitchen, but it works. Uh, well, it don't feel good. Oh, no. Well, you go over here, design group, stuff like that. Peterson did stuff here. Peterson was the fishbowl, eating room. Uh, and I know you have no sense of where everything is laid out in this building, but once you're actually here and you walk around it for four days, it makes total sense. So, uh, go this way. This is cool, this is somebody over here, I don't wanna really bother her. Um, this is, it's not whiteboard table, but it's, it's a nice table that you can use measure. And check this out, pull it down, boom. And so you, what you'll notice is there, oh, no, I've messed up, I've messed up, I've messed up. No, I haven't, I have solved it. There we go. And so you see, everything is just completely moved around and it's completely different every single time. Those stools are really cool. They can be used to like hold up posters and stuff like that. And we go out here. This is cool, look, it's a garage, that's neat. And look, you actually see the rest of Stanford and everything. Hopefully you can pick that up. And uh, that concludes our tour. It's cool. All right, one more thing. This is the space. This space is cool. This is where the actual D school office and everything is. It's really neat. I really like it. All right, good stuff. You know, see inside the car. Oh, it's cool. You guys should play music out of that. Hey, how's it going? Cool. Thank you. This space looked completely different. I didn't get a picture of it in the 360 camera because I thought it would stay. It did not. But that's a very good... Uh, imagine this looking completely different and now you kind of get my drift. Okay, now I'm really done.